Hey guys, it's Rob Seepak with Paperless Humans. In today's video, we'll be going through everything you need to know about live text on the iPad. Before we get started, please note that live text doesn't work on all iPads that are running iPadOS 17. It's not supported on some iPads. With that out of the way, live text can help you quickly pick up text from pretty much anywhere. To get started, go to your iPad camera and then go to photo as though you want to take a photo. When your iPad detects some text, it displays a live text icon on the top right corner. You can capture the text by tapping the live text icon to start interacting with it. You then get options to copy all to paste in any app so you can start working with the text. You can also just copy. To interact with specific text, you need to either tap or swipe it. You can then select all or look up a few words to search them on the web. This feature doesn't work when you pick up too many words. It's best to stick to fewer words. You get the option to look up single words using the dictionary on your iPad. You still have the option to search the web but if you want to go there directly without going to look up first, you can access that from the menu option. You can translate to other languages using the translate feature in iPadOS 17. which we'll cover in a different video. The iPad can also read out your selected information using Speak. Binding electrons more tightly. The iPad can even spell out words for you. B I N D I N G. Not the most natural voice to listen to, but it works. Share lets you export the text as a document to any app that can process text information. So that can be messages, mail, Apple Notes, etc. Live text also works on handwritten notes as well. You can also use live text on photos that are already in your photos library. When an image contains text, the live text icon appears on the bottom right corner. And you have all the options for the feature. Live text also works on videos in your photos library. To use it, you have to pause or stop the video and the live text icon appears when it picks up any text in your video.
and you can start interacting with it. You have to long press to interact with your text for both images and videos. In the Files app, Live Text also works on images and videos. Scans also work with Live Text by simply long pressing the text to bring up the pop up menu. Unique to Scans is the option to highlight. You can then get some five colors. Underline and strike out options for your text. Underline and strike out also highlight the text. In case you want to remove the highlighter, tap on it and go to remove. If your text is underlined or struck out, the app will remove that first and then the highlighter. You can also choose to add notes if you have any comments on the annotation. The iPad adds a sticky note for your comment that you can tap on to read it. In Apple Notes, Live Text works on images and videos. With videos, we recommend you play them in full screen mode for the best experience with Live Text. When you stop a video, go to the three dots icon and show text to activate Live Text. That will allow you to select some text for the pop-up menu to show up. Sometimes it's possible to do this without expanding the video to full screen, but it's not that reliable. Instead of typing out some text, you can extract it using live text. Tap the camera icon on the toolbar and scan text. You can also long press an empty space to bring up the pop-up menu. Then go to autofill and scan text. The app will pick up text that you can add to your notes. Tap insert to add all the text the camera has picked up. When you want to add specific text, you have to use the live text icon and select the text you want before inserting it. In any text field, you can scan instead of typing. In messages, for example, tap on the cursor to bring up the pop-up menu and go to autofill and choose scan text.
You can do this with most apps where you need to type. And that brings us to the end of this video. We hope you found it useful. Give it a thumbs up if you did. Thank you. Fantastic human for watching. See you in the next episode.